Good morning, everybody. I hope everyone's having a fantastic day so far. Um, up, normal person time again. So this is this is a good, good streak. Let's just hope we can keep it going. I don't know what the plan is, but yeah, thanks for stopping by. I hope everyone's still having a fantastic day. Hello, everyone. It is so late of me getting on the vlog because I just did. Well, first off, I took an everything shower, and then I did laser hair removal treatment which i have an at-home laser hair removal thing that i got for a brand deal so i've been testing that out and it takes it's quite time consuming when you do your armpits and your legs because it's like this much like laser you have to do that all over your whole legs and armpits and everything anyway so my plan today i'm going to eat some food because it's 2 30 and I have yet to eat some dinner, okay? I'm gonna do my nails because yesterday one of my nails popped off and I'm gonna test out my new cat eye gel polish. So, I'm gonna eat some food. Remember yesterday when I said Fasole is my life, my love, my everything? I gained three pounds last night from how much Fasole I ate, which is wild for me because I don't eat that much food. I can't eat that much food, except Fasole apparently. I didn't really need proof that I like Pasole, but proof enough, I suppose. Except I'm gonna be really sad because we're gonna be out of this soon and I'm maybe I'll just make more immediately after it's gone. A little protein powder, which is good. Two scoops daily or as directed by your healthcare professional. Alright. I guess we'll see. It also doesn't feel like there's a scooper in here. Oh there is! It's a little scoop. What does this smell like? Nothing. Does it taste like anything? It tastes like nothing. That's perfect. Great. Lovely. Wonderful. Okay. Two scoops of this. I'm just double checking the test and say it has flavoring to it. I don't think it does. So, I'm going to put <laughs> lemonade in this. Because, why not? I added my lemonade and ice and water. Ooh, that's disgusting! This is not a great first experience. The chunks are not going away. Maybe? Possibly? It doesn't look like they are. I might dump this whole thing. Which is terrible, I know. But I don't think those are gonna mix, so because the only problem is I put it I put ice in first, and then I put in the powder, and then I put in the water. So it chunked up before anything even. So maybe I need to put it in a little cup of water and stir it in there really quick. I found this. We're just gonna put it in this and shake the crap out of it. Hold on, ready? Some water. Okay. Get this. One. Okay, it's in there. Now we're just gonna shake the crap out of this and see if that'll work. I think that's already working better. Holy crap, yes it is. Okay, this was a better idea than the other one I had. Got my lemonade and now I gotta add this. Does it smell? Yes, that smells terrible. Okay, that's fine, it's yellow. All right, let's see if I can taste a difference. Ready? I don't think I can. I think we're good. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Oh, I usually do while Danielle plays. Well, not play, but she does her nails. And that's why in this other room, because she's just like right there. So that way it's quick for her to give me little updates. And I just play games, whatever game. Yeah, I just sit here and play games, and then when she's all done, she comes in and shows me, and I love looking at her finished product whenever she does her nails. We did it, Nala, we won. High five. Good gaming, buddy. No, no high fives. You just a good, you just a good key, key, key. Good buddy.
I just finished my nails. And it's a good thing I started when I did because I 100% ran out of time. So I chose blue. I like them. I think they turned out really cool. Ty just going to the bathroom and I said I'll meet you in the car so that we can actually leave. So let's start. Try it again. I have to mark ball my dad. Okay, let it turn off. Turn it I, off. I am. Is your foot off the brake? You have to do that. I know, but usually even if you do it, it turns it off. Okay. Okay, mark ball my dad. I guess we'll leave it and see if it's dead when we get back. Yay! So happy about this. We are leaving Ty's grandparents' house right now, and then we're gonna go to my parents' house to take care of the kittens real quick. Um, but we're gonna run and take care of them, and those are nice cars. <laughs> <laughs> and we have to hurry and take thumbnail pictures before the sun is completely gone, um, because we have videos going out tomorrow that we need pictures for, and I upload videos the day before. Stuff. Anyway, lots of stuff. Not lots, but some stuff. Smile. Put your hands close to your face. No. Like, I use your eyes. No. No. <gasps> no. I'm doing, we're doing the same thing. <laughs> You're going, <gasps> go. We're doing the same thing. <laughs> there we go. Thumbnail pictures are done. Oh, we took pictures for the thumbnail. But now we're gonna take care of the animals and weigh the, ki weigh the kittens, make sure they're growing properly, and then we'll head home to do everything else. chunkiest one. Gotta carefully put you in there. 9.1 ounces. Holy cow, girl. Oh, I know. I love how Mim, she hears the kittens crying and she's like, oh, let me just look really quick. Oh my goodness. You are so beautiful. I know. I just want to sit here and snuggle you guys. Okay. 8.6 ounces. Hi. Are you not gonna make any sound? There's a little meow. What? What? You are so pretty too. 8.7, so blue is the lightest. Come here. Thank you so much. Thank you, Mim Kitty, for letting me hold your babies. You're such a good mama. Yes, you are. Oh, you're such a good mama. All right, let's see if we just let the battery die out. Well, the battery didn't die out because... It's still going, I know. I like how confident you are with that, but the battery light is everything is on. Yeah. So... We just have to, on, the oil lights on, we let's leave it switch. tonight, try again in the morning, and we'll try it. My dad said to try jumping it because we left the lights on and that could have messed it up. We are going to watch a show together, an episode of a show together really quick. And I said, Ty, do you want a micro or a mug cookie? So we're going to make mug cookies really quick. And I'm going to tell you how. To start off with, you need one and a half tablespoons of butter. And I'm going to use already softened butter. Oh, this dish needs to be cleaned so bad. I have the butter, 
in both of these. And then you need brown sugar. And then you need one large egg yolk for both of these. Um, I'm gonna crack it into a container so I can eat the egg whites for breakfast tomorrow. And then I'll put the egg yolks one into both of these. Now you need a drop of vanilla or like one eighth teaspoon. But I'm almost out, so I'm just gonna do a drop. Oh. Beautiful. Okay, now you need three tablespoons of flour. So for ties, I'm gonna do brown rice flour. It's gluten free, and for mine, I may do one more because I'm not gluten free. So one, two. Now you just need to add some salt, just a little bit, and some chocolate chips. But I'm gonna stir these first, and then I'll add the chocolate chips. Okay, I'm just mixing mine right now, but I added um, two tablespoons of chocolate chips to ties, and I put it in the microwave for one minute. And um, you can, it says that you can microwave it from like a minute to a minute and 30 seconds until it seems ready. So I'm just gonna start with a minute so I don't overcook it. And then I will put mine in there. And then we're good. Okay, let's take ties out and see if it's done. It's not, so we're gonna do, um, we're gonna do another 30 seconds starting. We have stumbled upon a new event. Ties was not cooking. I think because of the rice flour. And so I kept warming it up three minutes at a time but this chocolate smells burned. Bad baking skills. Let me warm up, let me cook mine before any of you decide to, it's popping. Let me cook mine before any of you decide to trust me full heartedly. Actually, you know what? I know I won't eat my whole thing. I'm just gonna share it with Ty, because that does not smell great. Now I'm craving pozole more than a cookie, so looks like I might be eating pozole again. Are we shocked? No. All right, I've never tried this recipe before. I don't want to cook it any longer because I'm afraid it will burn. So, shall we try a, a, a wee bite? Firstly, this recipe is not it, I don't think. Mm -mm. That's severely unsatisfying. No, Ty, this is all you, bud. Here you go. I tried to easy bake, and I guess that's why easy, me? hold the handle. That's why I'm, that's why easy bake ovens are no longer a thing, I suppose. Don't, don't, don't tease her. She can't um, eat it. She was just smelling it. She's smelling it because she's scheming on how she can steal it. I can't eat it yet. It's too hot. Okay. Guess what? What? Let me see your nails right now. I don't think we showed the camera. <laughs> Let's see them. They're so pretty. We should have waited for better lighting. Yeah. Or got not waited, we should have done it earlier. Yep, we should have, but... I'm welcome, babe. You're I so good. I have to say, I appreciate how, even if you really don't care, you pay attention to my nails, and you make it a big deal, and it makes my heart feel so happy. I love you. I said tight. I did one set of workouts, just the one. I did sit-ups with um, kettlebell presses with in between every sit-up, and then I did so I did 25 of those, so 25 sit-ups and 25 kettlebell presses, I guess, and then I did 25 Russian twists. Oh, no, and I also did 25, um, you put the kettlebell on the ground, and then you lay on your back, and you put your legs over the kettlebell, and you don't let your legs touch the ground, so it's an ab workout. I had 25 of those, and then I did one where you bend your knees and push it out to both sides, so 
more ab workouts. Never, I hate working out. I hate it so bad. And everyone keeps telling me, one day you're gonna like working out. I hate it. What day? <laughs> what day am I gonna start liking working out? I hate it so much. The only reason I went to the gym every day before, when I was going to the gym every day, was because I got a see tie. That was literally the only reason. I didn't enjoy working out. I enjoyed seeing Ty, and now we're married. Anyway, I'm getting ready for bed. You guys wanna know something that I've been struggling with a lot lately? And this is not me complaining, this is me using my platform as a way to be as human as possible. Okay, so being a social social media influencer, everyone thinks, not everyone, there's a lot of people who think I have my life together and I don't. I know it's crazy and I also know there's a lot of you out there who know I don't have my life together because you're constantly commenting about it, which is fine. That's why I signed up for as an influencer, right? Something that people, I guess, don't recognize or I didn't think would happen is people think that because I'm an influencer and because I'm on screen and because I do all these things that I don't look at other influencers and other Instagrammers and other TikToks and compare my life, which is crazy because I do. <laughs> and I compare my life so much um, with a lot of things with, I don't know, the biggest thing right now that I'm struggling with is I don't understand why I'm not motivated. And this is not me saying, oh, today I'm not motivated. This is not me saying, oh, my life is so hard. I'm just, I genuinely don't understand not what is wrong with me. I don't want to use the words wrong, but I don't understand why I see people <laughs> around me who are so normal and they find it so easy to get up at the same time every morning. And they find it so easy to have meal plans that you follow and so easy to have everything organized all the time. My bathroom counter is a disaster right now, but it's an organized disaster and I know where everything is that I need, but that's not my point. My point is I don't understand why this person over here is so motivated and they don't have to try and they're so motivated to get up in the morning at a certain time and get ready in the day by a certain time and they're so motivated to eat breakfast, lunch, and dinner and it's good healthy foods and they don't, I'm trying to find a way, a way to describe it, but I know there's other people out there who are looking at other people and feeling the same way because what I learn from being an influencer is there's no, no such thing as an original experience. Um, whatever you're going through has happened to someone else in some point of that time at some place around the world and so I know that I want to talk about these things because there's going to be someone who resonates with it. And so this is not me complaining. This is me expressing. Let me wash my face. Hold on. Let me. I'm going to not remember what I was going to say. Anyway. Um, so this is not me in no way complaining. So please. The specific few of you who take everything I say as a complaint. I'm not complaining. I know there's someone else watching this feeling the same way. And if I had someone to talk about these things, who I looked up to or whatever, who I idolized, it would help me out a lot. And I'm just saying that I don't understand why me as a person, I can't be consistently motivated like so many people. And it's so frustrating in the most normal way because this has happened since I was little. I'd go to my friend's house and my room was always spotless. And I'd always be like, well, like, how do you... It's always like, how do you keep your room clean all the time? And I would keep my room clean at certain times. It wasn't a constant. It was whenever I got the motivation to just get it done or whenever my parents yelled at me to do it because they were sick of me waiting for that, you know? Let me backtrack. What I'm talking about is there's people who can work out every single day. And there's people who can get up and drink a protein shake for breakfast every day. And then they 
get dressed and they work out and then they have this whole regimen they follow and it's not because they have to follow it it's just because it's normal for them and they're motivated to get it done and they're maybe I'll delete this whole thing I don't know what I'm trying to express maybe I'll keep it because maybe there's someone out there who's trying to express the same thing I don't know somewhere out there there's someone who's feeling the same way I am and needs to hear this from someone and they're not so that's why I'm ranting and that's why I feel it important to rant about these things that I'm feeling and I know there's a lot of you that take it as me complaining I'm not complaining I am just trying to find a way to express it Bella. I think it's time to get her a friend. <sighs> this mask that I just put on, it's a tightening mask. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this. <laughs> I guess if I'm just going to sleep, but this is a weird, you have to like, it slides down. I don't know what I'm trying to say. This mask is gonna give me I probably should have put this and my hair together before I put this mask on, but it's fine. I don't know how much, how thick is it supposed to be? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so Danielle finished um, work and got all ready for bed. I got off the game um, and it's not super late yet. So we're gonna try to go to bed to try to keep the waking up and being productive ball rolling. We wanna keep it rolling. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna to go to bed so we can. So thank you guys so much for watching. We love you guys. Always remember that you are worth it. Bye guys.